on so that way we can I'm detecting look at it now? I don't know. What is this? Oh. You're the person we have to turn we something tried to into. Take down this place for months, and you made it look so easy. Destroying the command structure eh, systems like leaves the rest of the kept vulnerable. Almost Remember an hour. Janik? The shield around it's come down. The frozen city? That's the one. This is the perfect opportunity for a final push while they're still dealing with the chaos. Um oh, okay, so that so she was talking about that shield area. Uh, that's over there by the, the relic that we need, so I guess we'll go over there. I didn't know that there was going to be people there, though. Yeah. Tell me about this ancient city. They say it was abandoned when the scourge hit. The cold came and it was trapped in ice. The Ket learned we were investigating and took it. They think they can plunder it for remnant secrets. Let's hope they haven't completely destroyed everything. Remnant secrets. Um, I'll resupply in Tetrix first. I need to get back to Tetrix first. Resupplying? I suppose that's wise. We can take my shuttle. Let's go. Nice. All right. I don't need to really go there, but I'll take a free ride out of here. Tetrix, according to my map. <sighs> Tetrix, according to my map. Yeah. Investigating the ice cave. Oh, is that... Yep, okay. So, we tried to get this um, relic. I thought it was above ground, but apparently it's not. There was a giant shield uh, thing over here, and now that it's gone, we can go under the ground and grab it. Okay. I'm down. I'm down for that. We can do that. So, we'll do that real fast. Um, let's go ahead and just fast travel there. And then we'll leave this planet, we'll go to Havaral, do the vault, and whatever else is there. I, we only explored like half of Havaral. The other side required us to, I don't know, somehow find a way to, to summon a bridge so we can get to the old city. Um, which we have not done, and I don't know if you can do it or not, but... Uh, also on Havaro, there was a place called the Remnant Abyss, and that that was when we first found the Destroyer uh, enemy. So I think we go back down in there and, and take it out, because you know I know how to take them out now. Without their shields, taking out these guards shouldn't take long. They're not as scary. So we I got we got a lot of stuff now. To start doing. Super excited. Yeah, get get up there a little bit closer there. Oh, there's a turret there. Lol, just completely bypass the turret, it's fine. Also, when we uh, decide to leave this planet, we'll probably take a uh, quick break or so. That we can uh, stretch our legs and all the temperature that. temperature is falling, Pathfinder. They said there were guards here. Where are the guards at? I'm detecting below normal temperatures. Oh. Those are rates though. Those aren't guards. Three hours in stretching and you call yourself a gamer? Yeah, man, you you know, you don't want to get blood clots or anything. Didn't happen. Environmental temperatures are within acceptable limits. Life support is back online. Okay. 
Whoa. Nice. If I ever did a 24 hour stream, there would have to be breaks throughout the uh, the entire thing. That way I can stand up and all that. I'm reading a temperature decrease. So are we getting close to this relic or what? Yeah, we're kind of getting there. Are within acceptable limits. Uh oh. That's what you got pee bottles and pizza for, says Remington's. This is some heavy excavation. Twenty-four hour streams are serious yeah, business. Oh God, I'm dead. Yeah, 24 hour streams are serious, man. And you gotta make sure that you. Um, Life support restored. You eat, like, sort of healthy snacks, not like, you know, food that's gonna make you sluggish. Uh, and including, like, candy and, like, caffeine and all that stuff. You don't wanna crash. So. If I ever did one, there's a lot that would have to be. Have to go into it. Bold cave. Okay. Here we go. Let's explore this little cave here. I'm reading a temperature decrease. I know a guy who did 36 hours recently. Oh my god. I can't I can't imagine going that long. A long time ago. Um, one of the DMs for one of the Dungeons and Dragon shows that used to be around, um, the DM did like some crazy marathon stream where he would, where he tried to stay up for like five days straight or something like that. Like, and I think he did it. It was a, it was like two or three years ago. It was pretty insane. I remember watching a bunch of that. wonder what happened to the people. Sam, do we know how long this place has been trapped in ice? Angara researchers hypothesize over 500 years as a result of the Scourge event. That would make sense. Uh-oh, this is where... Show me how big this is. Ah, uh, it's not that bad. Yes. Are they coming up? It's kind of cool in here, though. How do people not die? I don't know. It sounds like staying awake for a certain period of time, like long periods of time like that, is not good, but... There's only been, like, a couple of people that have died, but they've had other issues. Like heart problems and stuff. This cave. Clear out, clear the cat out. Clear out the cat. I could fall asleep in the middle of a sentence after 24 hours. I. I'm reading a temperature decrease. 
like, I don't know, back when I was probably like, maybe like 12 or 13, I tried a 24 hour thing and it was like, I, I managed to stay up for 24 hours, but I was also up prior to that, so it was probably somewhere close to like 36 hours. Um, and then I just remember falling asleep and sleeping for like 16 hours or something like that. <laughs> it's pretty crazy, man. I wouldn't recommend it, but environmental temperatures are within acceptable 24 hour streams can be pretty fun. Especially if, if the person is so sleep deprived, they're not making sense or there may be something they're having a rough time. It's kind of it's kind of fun to watch people struggle, you know, trying to stay awake. Ah, here it is. Here is that Angaran artifact. What is it? Statue. Artwork was carved from marble. That's what we need. Is this Angaran? It looks strange. Doctor hey, Strange. Will know more about it. Put it in cargo. Avela. Yeah, I don't know, we might romance Avela, the Angaran. I'm reading a normal temperature range, Pathfinder. Life support. I wouldn't stable. try, nothing can take my beauty sleep away, says Remington's. Yeah, I, I need my sleep. Some of these are the only cats here. Oops. We must free them. They could help us. Well, I gotta. Uh oh. Nope, you're not killing me today, bro. Okay, this time I'm going to free them. Because last time we came across something like this, I freed them after the fight, and you're supposed to do it during so they help you. Come on out, you're free. Every game, you can feel like Abraham Lincoln and free the slaves. Happened in Fallout all the time, uh, and here we are doing it here. Okay. So you want us to go that way. What's over here, though? What is this? Loot? The temperature is falling, Pathfinder. Oh. Environmental temperatures are within acceptable limits. Okay, let's go, men. Can't save it. Oh cool, you can just do that while you're still scoped. That's kind of nice. There we go. The temperature is falling, Pathfinder. There's all these dead cat right here. <laughs> Talk to the rescued Engarin. Go back. Is this the end of the cave or what? I guess we'll go back and talk. Because we might be done here, it's looking like. I'm detecting below normal temperatures. Hello. That's all the cat, and we we're really free. Will you be okay? Can you make your way from here? Yes. 
with the cat gone, I can lead the others safely back to Tetris. I, I don't know how to thank you. I can tell you what I know about this place, if, if that would help. That would help a lot. The Ket are trying to get into a room behind that wall. Some time ago, they detected something and focused their attention on getting to it. Hmm. That ice wall looks meters thick. The Ket made us carry explosives here. They, they were preparing to blast through. You, you could do the same. Is there anything more I can tell you? If not, I, I ache to see the sky again. Um, what? Well, how did you get captured, first of all? Why were you captured? We were taken during a raid on our village. They took us to a camp, put us in groups. And then there was some kind of process, blood taking, examinations. I, I, I can't even remember all the tests. Exaltation stuff. Eventually, they split us into groups. They said my group was flawed. Or m maybe, maybe it was unworthy. Unworthy of exaltation, I assume. Way over there. What do you, what's behind the wall? What exactly is behind that wall? I don't know. Something old. Something that excited the cat. I thought I heard one of them ask if it was still, uh, functional. Perhaps some sort of machine. I am super intrigued. Let's go see what this is before we leave the cave. I won't keep you here. There's nothing else I need from you. Good luck. I hope you find what you're looking for. Be careful. Oh, heck yeah. Oh, it's over there. Okay. Well, what was over here then? Before we walk over there. I'm reading the normal well, temperature range, Pathfinder. I better go check it out first in case I have to go deeper. Remington says I'm having deja vu. Useless and Gara thanking for saving them. <laughs> we need to figure out how to get behind this wall. A scan might help. Maybe I could break it. The wall's a few I meters thick. A strong unidentified energy signature emanating from behind that wall. So there really is something back there. It also looks like we're going to have to blast our way through with the explosives around here. Think we have enough? Ooh. I'd say so. We don't want to bring the entire place down on ourselves. Clear the blast zone? Uh-oh. A temperature decrease. Okay, all right. Here we go. The ambient temperature is normal. I hope they find a quarry okay. inside. No one crushed by falling ice? All accounted for. And the blast brought the wound. That actually down. would be kind of funny if there was a quarry in back here. And then people are like a lot of people didn't do this uh mission. Whoa. There's uh some sort of machine it looks like and there's uh eyeballs. You got eyeballs on the right and you got boobs on the left. Like this cave. What the heck is this? It's beautiful. But what makes this place so interesting that the cat would fight for it? It almost looks geth. Greetings. Like... How can I assist? What are you? An interface for the power grid of this city. I have been operational since the city was encased in ice. But shot. She is lying. This is an AI, and her origin appears to be Angaran. She is lying? Uh-oh, don't tell me you're gonna Wizard of Oz me. You're not going to Wizard of Oz me, are you? What? The Agar are advanced, but I haven't heard anything about living AI. Our old history doesn't describe one. 
This is amazing news. Go get the commander. So tell me, why lie? As you can see, I am currently vulnerable. What happened here? The Ket aliens talked as though I was evil and disgusting. They planned to take my knowledge and then kill me. I fought them off, but my energy stores are now drained. I am near death. Another lie. She is tied to a deep power grid. I beg you, have pity on me. Do not take me from here. I would rather die. I am tired. I am done. That's insane. You're an extraordinary find. A key to our past. Am I? You are not the ones who designed me. I do not trust you any more than I do the Ket aliens. Or these other aliens. I would rather die. Ryder, she has now blocked my attempts to scan her. Okay, this is... I'm open to suggestions here. Options? Thoughts? Thoughts? I'm taking her out of here. That's what I... No! I am tired! I will not go! I am afraid! So afraid! And angry! Help! Help me! Please! I have a family! A life for a life? Is mine really more valuable than his? I don't want to kill the AI, I want to know more about it. I have no idea what we stumbled upon here, but I am intrigued. I don't think I can kill it. I need to know more. I'm not shooting the AI, I'm not doing it. You're too valuable. I'm sorry. You really didn't have to do that. With my fate now in your hands, consider it a warning. But your future is exciting. You can help the Angara recover what they lost to the Scourge. I do not know them. I owe them nothing. But your AI, I do understand him. Place me in his custody. No. No. Wow. Let's pause and think about no, this. No, GLaDOS, I'm not letting you in. Everything always be about borders. If, at this moment, Sam can best help this AI, then let's share her. Sure, but the optics are bad. Plus, we already know there's anti-AI sentiment on the Nexus. I want to be with Sam. I have a consciousness. I have desires and feelings. Please, Pathfinder. Oh my god. Keep AI to work with Sam, or give the AI to the Angara. So, the Angara are going to be super upset if I keep it. Now, I don't know how much I trust an AI, okay? I trust you enough to just not kill you right now, because I want to know more about you. So, it kind of sucks for that Angaran dude that just died. Um... I don't feel comfortable keeping the AI, first of all, but if it's going to be working with Sam, it seems interesting. Give AI to the Angara. Ryder said something about uh, help the Angara recover what they lost in the Scourge. Whether any of this stuff has any effect, who knows. There's only one person that knows about the AI down here, and that's the person that left. When they come back, we could be like, you know what, the AI just uh, shocked this guy and then went down. I don't know if I should give it to him. Maybe we keep it. I have a consciousness. I have desires and feelings. You know what? I think we're gonna keep it. This might be pretty interesting. Let's abide by her wishes. Joel, Liam, make the diplomatic arrangements. At least the cat didn't get her. Okay, team. What's next? That's it. 
Wow, okay, I thought there was going to be more there, but apparently not. I'd give it away, says Remingtons. That's probably the more noble thing to do. But I want to know more about this AI. Well, it was interesting up until that choice, and then there wasn't much said afterwards, so... That kind of sucks. Can't scan these. Well, I think that concludes... Favaro. Is there things that we... Well... Let's get out of here first of all. And Garin AI. I want to know more. Noble? I was thinking along the lines of... Not having a psychotic, lying AI added to my brain. <laughs> Noble as in... If it can help the Angaran recover uh, from the Scourge. Seems that's where the nobility comes in. But yeah, you're not wrong. Life support restored. Okay, I want to see this other side over here. And I think we might have some missions to quickly turn in. I don't know if, if we do or not. But I could turn those quickly in. Oh wow, this is it? Dead end. Okay, alright. Wait, is it? The ambient temperature is normal. I have no idea where I'm running to. Okay, I'm this is below normal temperatures. Where the heck are we at? Okay, so we're back. Okay, so it loops around. Gotcha. Okay. It went that way, yeah. Environmental temperatures are within acceptable limits. Life support is stable. Uh oh, they're waiting for us. Decrease. All right, cool. Let's go back to the surface. We'll look at the map. See if there are any. I'm a temperature decrease. If there are any things on the map where we can just quickly turn the submissions in, we'll do that. Otherwise, we'll just abort the Tempest and go to Havaro and do the vault. And then once we finish the vault on Havaro, then uh, we'll probably shift the focus to some loyalty missions. Check some of those out. The only one we have right now is Liam. I'm detecting um, below normal temperatures. And we might know stuff like about the Tur well, the Turian arc we know where it is, I think. And then the Asari arc we're still kind of waiting to hear uh on. Um But yeah, we've got those, and then aside from that, this guy we gotta turn something in. Aside from that. Um, it's pretty much just main story, I guess. And I, I Environment seriously checks. hope it's to the point where acceptable parameters. I hope it's to the point where life support is back online. It's just main story. We can just focus on story and not focus on finding a planet and having to explore it and all that crap. Because aside from Havaro which has like a whole eastern side which we can't reach yet. Uh, everything's been pretty much explored. I've entered the destruction of the Kerton 